Brian Anderson. Ali LaForce on the sidelines. And so off the tip, it's Washington. Out to the wing. And here's Lillard from beyond the arc. Damian Lillard. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. Endure so much about playing well in the late stages of the season comes down to health and depth. You start to consider the minutes and the games logged from all of these players. Bench depth, deep rotations really start to show at this point of the season because you can have fresher legs. And it's Simons penetrating. Back to Lillard. To the left wing. Six to shoot. Trailblazers got to hurry. Got to get up a shot. And Porzingis with the block. And we're about a minute into the first. Over to the left wing. Here's Neto. Looking at his stats, he's putting up about seven and a half per game. Here's Beal. Soft touch off the glass. You can make the case this is the premier shooting guard in the league. Bradley Beal is tough to stop. One challenge for Kristaps Porzingis has been his health because over the course of his young career, he's missed about a quarter of the schedule to injury. Portland foul. Brendan Watford. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Just over a minute and a half in. Beal, no good. Endorsed throughout the league's history. A lot of players well over seven feet tall have dealt with leg issues. Yeah, in fact, even after the Knicks drafted Porzingis, if you recall, the front office questioned how he hold up. But boy, KP has put a lot of work into strengthening that lower body, getting down in the stance to hold ground and protect himself a little bit. Who is stolen by Lillard. Out to the right wing. Pass to Nurkic. Lillard outside. A step back shot. Another miss. He's two for four. Neto attacking. Now here's Kuzma. Out to Beal. To the inside. Here's Neto. Clock at six. Here's Porzingis. Out to Beal. With the drive. And then Beal with the dunk. This guy's in attack mode. Bradley Beal taking it strong. Time out on the floor. Trailblazers, time out. in the first quarter about three minutes played two minutes, two minutes Lillard outside the first quarter. Two pass to McLemore fires the three and he gets it back and there's a pick to the paint another shot Just and it's Winslow Winslow laying it in just keeping the game simple. Lillard's patience and acute understanding of pick and rolls comes in handy. Beal outside. He nails it, and we're tied. Beal's got his third basket of the night. And credit his teammates for feeding him all quarter. Now here's Lillard. He's got five. Shot clock at six. Pass to McLemore. Let's it go from deep. Oh, he drains the three, and he'll go to the line for one more. first personal. It's going to be on Bradley Beal. One oh five left to the first. 
Here's Neto. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Beal, no good. Well, seized up just a little bit at the last second. That's one he normally converts. Out of bounds. And it's out of bounds. The Trailblazer is able to retain possession here. Six seconds left in the first quarter. Takes the three. Rebound Washington. This is the first time they've seen Portland this season. There's the triple. And the Wizards with another three. We're talking about one of the sweetest shooting guards in the entire NBA. Bradley Beal from deep. Yes, sir. Here's McLemore. Six second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Porzingis sets a screen. And Bradley Beal is going to pick up the foul. That's foul number two for him. That's already this guy's second foul now. He's either going to have to sit or play a bit more conservatively. Timeout on the floor. Washington timeout. For your wizards. There's a screen. Pass to Ellaby. Oh, deflected. Ooh, stolen by Smith. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Trailblazers out in front. If you're just joining us, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And what stands out to you from the Trailblazers in this one? They're getting a big contribution from the bench already. As a coach, I think you get a certain feel for what your team needs. And credit this guy for not waiting around. He went ahead and made the adjustment. All right, let's get a report from Allie. Thanks, Brian. Well, just about every discussion of the NBA trade market comes back to the Washington Wizards. An all-star shooting guard Bradley Beal on a team that hasn't made the playoffs in three seasons, something's got to give. And guys with Beal possessing an opt-out after the season, expect those talks to intensify. Yeah, that's a good point. This team looks to him to score the ball. They feel good when he's taking the shots. There is an imagination, a creativity. This guy's passing drives the offense. Here's Simons. The three is up. And again, and it's Bernie Portland Simons. with a three. three well, Grant, does it goal. seem like teams are carrying fewer specialists than they used to? You know, B.A., I actually think there's more specialists. I mean, think about it. You have certain players who can do everything, who are versatile, who can carry a team, but then you surround them and complement them with guys who can knock down open jump shots. So I actually think you have more specialists, a lot of them being shooters, who can space the floor for their ball club. Pass to Nurkic. Back to Simons. Let's go with a three. The rebound by the Wizards. And he probably thought he was going to bury that one. Inside. Out to Achimura. Back to Smith. And the foul on Josh Hart. That's his first foul of the game. That's his first personal foul. First team And the foul. Wizards call time here. Blazers They're moving on after the tough loss they took at the Damian hands of the Hornets. Miller. It really just wasn't a fun game for them. Their offense looked stagnant, and they couldn't get anything going. I thought they were outworked and outplayed in just about every phase of the game. Maybe that's one of those situations where you say, hey, let's move on. On defense, the Trailblazers. Castaneto. Four on the clock. Beal. Portland foul. 
Instead, he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Personal foul. Second Boy, foul. what I love about Bradley Beal is despite having one of the most gifted offensive games in the league, he never stops looking for improvement. This guy wants to up his game each and every season. Now Nurkic. Lillard outside. Pass to Simons. Drives to the hoop. Whoa! Simons. A floor general like Lillard won't miss that assist. He easily spots the wide open shooter and connects. Portland foul. Foul on Josh Hart. Hart. That's foul number two That's for him. Personal foul. To a certain extent, you like the aggressiveness, but that's two fouls already. Take a step back. And the Blazers making a change here. Out to Beal. From the arc. Rebounded by Winslow. Portland leading. Going inside. Lillard right side. 18 feet out. Over to the wing. It's hard on the wing. Beyond the arc. Rebounded by Kuzma. The Wizards on offense. Here's Beal. And then Beal with the dunk. But well, Bradley Beal works so hard to find the opportunities on the offensive end. He knows he's responsible to carry the load. Lillard outside. Pass to Winslow. Watford. Back to Winslow. For three, here's Lillard. It doesn't go for him. Beal outside. That one's good. This game is all even. Beal's got seven now in this quarter. He nailed two from distance in the opening period. Now gets this one. Pass to Simons. Back to Lillard. Here's Simons. Watford. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Porzingis. A swat by Porzingis. That wingspan letting you know he's in the house. All right. Coming on the court. Makes the noise for your Wizards and Zer. Two left in the first half. And the shot clock expires. 24 second violation. Here's Smith. Well, he hasn't put up any points yet in this one. Out to Beal. This one for three. And again, Washington with a triple. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. And Lillard gets it to go. Both teams are starting to find a rhythm here. And this is partly what the game has become, right? A matter of dueling three-point opportunities. Count it. Beal's got 22 points. Well, off the screen, you can see Bradley Beal is shot ready. That is how you do it. Pass to Little. For three, here's Lillard. To the wing, right side. Five on the clock. Eubanks in the high post. Over Gafford. It's hauled in by Beal. Well, certainly not the best defensive effort, but this guy can't make them pay for their laziness. Back to Smith. Deflected! Bradley Beal has been leading the charge for the Wizards. as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. The Wizards for the lead. What I admire about Bradley Beal is his steady growth, not just in his overall game, but how he's embraced becoming a leader. He's someone his teammates really look up to. He drops it from range. 
25 points in the game. What a beautiful stroke from range. Defensively, you've got to try to take him out of his comfort zone. Hey, expanding his range. Rebounded by Kuzma. Boy, Beal's rise continues to impress. Every season, Grant, he improves as a scorer, especially. And the older he gets, the more wisdom he attains. Both on and off the court, his guys expect him to lead the charge. It's something that he takes great pride in. Beal with it. Nurkic picks him up. Pulls up on the wing. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Outside Hart. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. Here's Nurkic. Second chance shot. Lillard outside. Oh, what a play. It snatched out of the air. Credit the block. Beal from outside. Oh, almost had a four-point play right there. But he'll go to the line with a chance for three. That's his first personal foul. Bradley Beal is one of the most difficult individuals to guard in the league. No surprise he comes up with the drawn foul there. And he nails the third. And we're about a minute and a half in the second half. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's a shot he typically makes. Oh, and he got Portland. fouled on his way up. He'll head Damian to the line to shoot two. That's his first. Damian Lillard picks one up. Second. Well, Bradley Beal is the epitome of being a triple threat. He can drive it, pass it, shoot it. The complete package on the offensive end that defines Bradley Beal. This is about the last guy you want to send to the stripe right now. They keep fouling him, and he keeps making them. McLemore gets the bucket. McLemore's got seven points. When the defense totally lost track of him, he punishes them with a three-pointer. That's a bad decision. Hey, man, who wants a teacher? Makes the boy! Substitution for your wizard. Smith outside. Now Achimura. How quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first point of the game. Well, there are times where the court vision gets questioned, but Ruby Hachimura, the delivery, sets up his teammate. Really well done. Hart from long range. Unable to get that one. Now Washington takes it the other way. Smith outside. Bryant outside. Off target. That would have pushed the lead to double digits. Portland trailing here. Pass to McLemore. Back to Simons. On the take. Avdia pulls it in. Boy, this guy is a good finisher, so he misses a chippy. That's tough to take. Back to Smith. Kicks it out to Bryant. From downtown. Rebounded by Nurkic. Well, they are daring him to miss, and he obliges. When you think about Thomas Bryant, the thing you think about is efficiency. He makes the most of his chances, and he doesn't force the issue. Out to the right wing. They set the pick. Six on the shot clock. Outside Hart. To the wing on the left. Simons. Pass to Ellaby. Second chance effort. Portland, no good that time either. A wasted trip down the floor. That's not a good shot at all. Well, missed opportunities, and they can certainly add up. You cannot afford to take that kind of shot. Hachimura from long range. So it's Portland now. Trailing by eight. Down low. Here's Ellaby. Ooh, good finish at the rack off the slick feed. In a tight game, they wanted to make sure of that possession. 
Smith with it. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Pass to Caldwell Pope. And here's Bryant. Hachimura outside. Off target there with a the little leaner. I don't know if he's trying to show off for the crowd or what, but there's no reason for that kind of shot. Here's Ellaby. Hachimura covering. To the middle. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. And now it's just a four point Washington lead. And here's Smith. Into the lane. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Personal foul. The officials were right on top of that one. That free throw, no good. At the line for Washington. That one's no good. And we've watched three That's so far in this one. Wizards out in front. Wizards up by four. Answer. And time for a... It's the fourth And with these teams locked in a very close contest, this fourth quarter promises to be a good one. And here are the Trailblazers now. Four-point game. Now here's Lillard. Rebounded by Kuzma. One reason this game is so tight is because both teams are hitting the boards with reckless abandon. Here's Beal. Oh, nice fake, but the layup's off the mark. Now Portland with it. Pass to Johnson. To the inside. Here's Little. Left side, Johnson. Here's Eubanks. Offensive rebound. You just have to love that grit and effort on the glass. No problems battling the basketball. And then Beal with the dunk. Great play off the bounce by Bradley Beal. He has added this methodically over the course of time. Go ahead, Bradley. Drive it, baby. Eubanks the screen. To the left side wing. Back to Lillard. Pass to Johnson. Whoop, there's the shot clock violation. So they'll turn it over. Washington basketball. About a minute and a half through the fourth quarter now. Yusuf Nurkic. John Hart. Here's Beal. Kuzma for three. Oh, a target from range. You can see the level of attention Bradley Beal draws. This guy is so heady finding the open teammate. Pass to Little. Fires the three. The Trailblazers rebound. Hart from long range. No luck on that one. The Wizards for the lead. Beal left side. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. Inside. Washington foul. Timeout Ooh. called. Portland. Hey, it's That's been quite a game for Bradley Beal. Yeah, I think they've got to be talking about just guarding him a little more tightly on the perimeter or keep the ball out of his hands as much as possible, period. That's about the only way you're going to pull this guy off. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Allie. Hey there, I was able to listen in on the Portland head coach talking to his team. He instructed his guys to buckle down, saying, quote, it's do or die time. Let's stay focused and finish like it's a playoff game. We'll see if they can pull it off. Back to you. Appreciate the report, Allie. Beal shot is off. There's Simons with a three. Drains the triple. Wow, you don't see him left alone very often. And of course, he makes good use of it. Pass to Beal. The three. Two minutes. Two minutes remaining in the Porzingis fourth quarter. sets a screen. Two minutes. To the paint. Oh, it's Porzingis with the jam. Well, this is 
an aspect where Porzingis has been criticized, not rebounding with authority, but boy, he does so there. The three ball. And Damian Lillard hits from deep. And defensively, how do you leave him that open in crunch time? A minute 37 left to the fourth. The fadeaway. No good off the back of the rim. Just a cold shooting night. Needs to try to make it into the basket. Good D by Porzingis. It's Beal on the wing. There's the three. He sinks it from distance. Beal's got 12 points here in the second half. This is unbelievable. He has over half the team's Damian points right now. And neither side right now giving an inch. We'll see who cracks first. Pass to Beal. Launches a three. Portland grabs the miss. Here's Simons. Lillard outside. Out left to the wing. Hard with it. Lillard right side. It falls! And he's brought them within two points now. And the stakes were high right there. What a bucket. I'll tell you, that changes things, doesn't it? Good job, young fella. What a game. And it's Beal penetrating. Rebounded by Nurkic. And he's easily led the way on the boards tonight. He's competed for every missed shot. Feels like he's quicker to the basketball than anyone else out there. And if you're guarding Dame in the pick and roll, you need to stop the ball. Lillard can just eat you alive. Now Beal. A shot is offline. Time. Boy, these teams have battled tooth and nail for four quarters. Now we're headed to we overtime. Go. This one should be fun. Lillard with the ball. Pass to Johnson. Down low. Four on the clock. Lillard outside. To take the lead. That shot missing. And Washington the other way now. Now Beal. And Bradley Beal is going to pick up the foul. That's his third foul so far. That's his third first Tough foul. one. In a game where every possession is valuable, turnovers can make the difference. Pass to Johnson. And here's Nurkic. Defended by Porzingis. From deep, Johnson. Rebounded by Kuzma. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Here's Neto. Here's Caldwell Pope. The three-pointer off the mark. You will not see this guy miss many of those. He's one of the keys to their floor spacing. Pass to Johnson. Back to Nurkic. Now Lillard. Now Johnson. Defended by Porzingis. To take the lead. And that one's good. Lillard. Lillard's got 21 points in the game. And once Lillard kicks it up a notch, watch out. Flat out taking over now. Caldwell Pope's shot is off. Portland leading. Outside Johnson. For three. It's stolen by Kuzma. It's Beal on the wing. Portland grabs the miss. 
Expect them to take their time this trip down. Yeah, B.A., the clock is theirs to burn. Pass to Little. Five to shoot. Here's the three. Oh, he drained it from downtown. Well, that's a case where your teammates are showing trust in you, and he comes through with flying colors. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Here's Caldwell Pope. Kuzma outside. It's Beal on the wing. It's Beal on the wing. From deep. That one is off. So it's Portland picking up the win. That's the end it was a touch and go there for a while, but in overtime, they caught Thank a second win. They really did, and it was wild. Everything it took Please just to get, get to the extra period, and then they're...